Hello everybody, Andrew Majewski here with Dental L. So let me show you guys what I have bought recently that has made my mobile practice so much easier. So what I had before was a big luggage, basically. I had a big one and then one of those carry-on ones. But as soon as I saw a patient um, who I went to their house and they had steps to go down. So they lived in a basement, um, a basement basically, where they had big steps off of the deck to go down. And I had to do that um, with all of my stuff. They were so nice. They did offer to help me, but I didn't, I didn't want them to do any work, you know? So I did it all myself. But imagine taking this big luggage thing down a series of steps. It was hard. And then I thought, well, I'm probably going to have other patients too that live in a basement where I have to go down steps or when I go to apartment buildings. It's just a hassle, honestly. And I don't need all of that stuff. So over time, I have kind of learned sort of what I need. And hey, if I need something else, I can just easily get it from the car instead of having to lug everything down there just in case I need something. So this is from Costco, you guys. Check this out. Check this out. This is awesome, right? Now, I do still need a couple other things to carry, like my piezo can't fit in here, my instrument trays can't fit in here, my portable com compressor obviously comes with his, its own thing, but most of my stuff can fit in here. So check this out. Pretty cool, right? So I kind of wanted to show you guys, but I need something higher, right? So, hmm, how am I going to show you guys? So I'm just going to open up everything like kind of one by one. So my favorite part is this top part actually. So this is this and I have a tray in there right now. Can I show you guys with just like some odds and ends? I'm just trying not to drop it, sorry. Oh, I have my webcam. Let me show you guys, hold on. Let me pause this and then I'll show you. Okay guys, sorry, so I'm hilarious. So I'm just gonna move the webcam, okay? Cause that would just be so much easier. This is pretty heavy. So check this out. Okay, now I have to move it closer. Hold on. You guys can see that I totally have my comfy pants on today. There. Actually, let me just move this. Okay, so sorry, you guys can see my comfy pants and my socks, but this is so much easier. Okay, let me move down this way so at least you guys can see me, right? So check this out. So yes, it's kind of messy now, but this helps me, like this whole top thing helps me so much because at the end of an appointment, you know. As you know, when you're working in the dental office, you're just kind of throwing things in. Yes, I do wipe everything, you know, all of that, but you just kind of throw things in. You're not being like careful to like put things, right? So this, I love this so much easier. I put things here that I might have to kind of like grab quickly, like micro brushes, um, just some extra gauze, um, piezo, you know, things like that, right? But this is obviously not as organized as I normally keep it, but this is dental professional life, right? We all like to think we're, we're the most organized person, but we're not. I keep a nice mirror here and my instruments in pouches. I do have a lot in the sterilizer at the moment, but as you guys can see, tons of my things all like wrapped up, ready to go. I have some pumice for when I do sealant and the whitening my curing light, safety glasses. I have just like some random saliva ejectors, which I do typically have somewhere else too, but sometimes I just miscalculate and I'll be like, oh, I need a saliva ejector, where is that? Bibs, obviously, but let me close this up and show you guys kind of my next compartment here. Just kind of lift that. There we go. Let's take this out. So this is probably my second favorite because this has pretty much everything that I need so almost so when I see a patient I will put the tray on the table and then I will just kind of lift things out from here like if I need for my um, profi hand piece this thing there I know that I will need some gauze um, I know that I will need some of the floss um, if I need of course a saliva ejector if I need something to hold the saliva ejector um, a couple things for the whitening, you know, just the little like uh, like odds and ends. Um, of course, some of my fluoride, which I am always pro fluoride. Some um, profi cups, you know, so just sort of little things like that to help to keep things organized. Oh, and these 
are for when I apply the silver diamine, it can stain black, right? So I just sort of put it on here, put it like up to the tooth with my micro brush and it's just so much easier to sort of like in and out, right? And then this goes in the garbage and this obviously too. Just in case you were wondering what these are, they're called um, tattoo rings. I got them off of Amazon, but they're very, very helpful. Okay, let me just put this back. And I keep my samples here, not all of them, because I have tons, but just if I needed some extra, because sometimes I will go to a house thinking I'm seeing like a mother and child, and then, oh, she has two more kids. Oh, her, her sister's here, so let me just see if she also needs a toothbrush, you know, things like that. So I just have a couple toothbrushes in here, some lip balm that I had made with my Dental L Mobile Hygiene. Check that out. Sorry, it's kind of hard to see with the light, but my goodie bags which oh my god you guys aren't these so cute so cute my whitening kits for take home and these work awesome by the way stickers for the kids and toothpaste for everybody so just kind of like little things here and there once again just like little things but typically i do have all of that prepared ahead of time because i am mobile so i have to be organized but as i said like these are more for if i'm going to somebody's house and oh they have the sisters who's who's here her dad's here here you know take a toothbrush you know and then hey do you want your teeth clean that kind of thing on the bottom is just sort of another thing where just like odds and ends so i have some extra bibs some cheek retractors, you guys, right here. Sorry, it's kind of hard with the light. My whitening solution is all inside of here. I can show you guys if you're curious. Of course you're here. Of course you're curious, right? So my whitening solution, I just sort of put like in a more organized manner in here. I have some separate syringes for take home um, and then for the um, in office or in home applications since I go to people's homes. I have these intraoral um, mirrors which are so helpful when I do my intraoral photos. Some more like cheek retractors and a shade guide. People love this by the way. People are like oh that's so cool. So even if you don't plan to do the whitening show them this and they will want to. So just a little tip for you. And some masks. Um, I usually keep my gloves and my like disinfecting tubs in a different container. There's so much stuff. When you travel to somebody's house, there's so much stuff. But this little thing here, honestly, you guys, it's pretty heavy because um, I do have a lot of stuff in there, as you can see. But this has saved me a ton. Like I would have put all of this in a big like luggage container and then I would have to look through the luggage container for all of my stuff. But as you can imagine, this is so much easier to carry than a big luggage thing. And it just looks to my patients that I have less stuff and that I'm not like moving in, you know, because I did have a lot of stuff. So sorry, let me move this. So I hope that helps. Sorry for the impromptu video there. I should have thought about that earlier, but pretty awesome, right, you guys? I'll just kind of show you guys that again. Oh, it's so heavy. This is from Costco. It was on sale, so I don't think it's on sale now, but that's from Costco. So thank you guys so much for watching. Whoops, let me adjust. Okay, I'm just going to adjust that later on. I don't know what I'm doing. There we go. So thank you guys for watching. If you have any questions, let me know. I do hope this helped to see how I keep things organized. I'm not perfect, but I'm learning as I go. So have a good day, you guys, and let me know if any questions.